Hello guys and welcome to TechPress. In today's tutorial, we're going to learn how to connect your Google Analytics into your system e.io account. This connection is key for anyone looking for gaining insights into their website traffic, understanding visitors' behavior and optimizing your digital marketing strategies, whether you are running online courses, sales funnels, or blogs, integrating Google Analytics will help you make data-driven decisions. Now, the benefits of integrating Google Analytics with system e.io. By connecting Google Analytics to your system e.io, it's going to be much more easier to gain access to detailed analytics about your visitors, about uh, interactions, and all your content. So this data is invaluable for optimizing your marketing efforts and improved user experience. So before we begin, and show you have a Google Analytics account and a system e.io account. First, let's set up a Google Analytics account to work with system e.io. Log in to your Google Analytics account and set the property you want to link to your system e.io. If you haven't already created a new property into your system uh, .e website, so navigate into the administrator section and here what you wanted to do is to go directly here into administrator and here have my create a new account. So once you create your account, what you want to do is to create a new property. Here into property, in this case, let's go for system e.io. The currency and the reporting time zone is totally up to you. Now the business details and the industry category once again is totally up to you. And I want to generate some leads and I want to track some composite. So hit into create and now here have to start collecting my data. Now integrating Google Analytics with system e.io. Now head over to your system e.io account. Here you wanted to go directly inside your settings directly inside your settings section, then find the third party tool tabs that appears into the left part. If you don't see this, you can always go into the sales funnel and you have the tracking code. So here tracking code, the code is inserted between head elements. So just leave this like that and now verify the integration. Enter the Google Analytics tracking ID into the designated field. Let's go back into analytics and choose web. Inside web, what you want to do is to type the website URL. In this case, I'm going to head down and go for custom domains. So, so far, as you can see, here's my domain name. I'm going to copy it and I'm going to paste it in here. So the stream name is going to be system E that IO. I create my stream. And as you can see here, I have the URL, the stream ID and the measurement ID. Usually it's going to be just as simple as to copy the ID and paste it inside the verification of the third party. But just in case, if this one once again does not appear, you can install this manually, which I think is going to be much more faster. Just hit it to install manually, copy all this snippet. Let's go back here into settings and here into the sales funnel, the tracking code should be pasted in here. And now let's hit into save. So the changes are now going to be saved. So with that being said, I'm going to hit now into test and it's going to be successfully done. Sometimes it won't be detected since it will be taking minutes, even hours to make the visualization of your testing. After entering your tracking ID, save the change to complete the integration. It's a good idea to verify that the tracking is working correctly. You can do this by visiting your website and then checking for real-time activity into your Google Analytics. And this will confuse the system e.io Google Analytics are properly connected. You want to make sure, of course, that you're not using more than one domain name. Of course, it's not going to be working. It's going to be just uh, delaying stuff. So make sure you're using just one domain and ready to use it. And that's how you have successfully connected Google Analytics to your system e.io account. If this tutorial was helpful, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to Express for more digital marketing and analytics tips. How many questions are inside about Google Analytics? You can let us know into the comments below. Thank you for watching and we wish you a great success with your analytics driven strategies. Stay tuned to TechFresh for more helpful guides. Hopefully you can all see you next time.